Hey, it's Paul Venables here and welcome to my Spin Rewriter review. In this video, I'm gonna share with you how you can use Spin Rewriter to easily get fresh, copyscape past, unique content to help rank your videos or any web properties that you have. And also, you can use these unique articles to sell as a service as well. And right now, we're inside of Spin Rewriter, which is a web-based app so it works on your Mac or PC or anything with an internet connection. And I'm using my account that I've had since 2013. I actually used a lot of different article spinners uh, back in 2010, 2011, 2012, tried different things out. There were some pretty good ones, some of which took a lot of time to get quality articles, and others were maybe simple to use, but they didn't really produce very good results. Well, Spin Rewriter came out and it combined the best of both worlds to make it simple for you to use, but also it was very powerful enough to give you high quality articles almost instantly so that you didn't have to do much work to get some really quality content. So I was very happy about that when I first learned about it in 2013 and I've been a happy customer ever since. So this has been an awesome tool. Along with that, uh, Aaron Suster, the guy behind this program, he's been upgrading it throughout the years, and each year there's a new version. We're gonna be on version 10. And along with that, this has been an amazing tool that has been upgraded every year and gets better and better and better. So it's been really cool to see that evolve and to be a part of that process to watch it get better and improve throughout the years. And version 10 will be released very soon here in one day from now, which will be October 10th. That will have a new look and feel to make it even easier to go through the user interface. And I'm gonna show you how I do that in a second. And when you're using version 10, it's going to be even easier to go through this process. So right now I'm inside of my Spin Rewriter version nine, and I'm gonna click into rewrite a single article just to show you what it's like to get this rewriting process started. So I'm gonna go down here, and then I'm gonna find an article. So there's a lot of ways you can find an article for Spin Rewriter. If you have an article you've written yourself, you can just paste it in here to get hundreds of unique variations. And something that I love about Spin Rewriter is that if you don't have an article or don't wanna go out and get one, you can just click Fetch a New Article and they have an enormous amount of articles you can use in a wide variety of niches that you can then spin to make very unique to use for whatever you want. So we can just type in weight loss and click fetch articles. And now it's going out into their big content search to see all the articles they have around the topic of weight loss. So we're just gonna give it a few seconds to load up. And as you can see, it's gone out and found a variety of articles. Uh, we have a hundred in total here. Uh, some of them that, that vary in different word counts. So this is uh, 623 words. This one's 1,285 words. And you can really niche it down too if you wanted to have something like weight loss for women. I've done that search as well. And you can uh, get more content around those topics. Now, if you have a very niche keyword, like how to train your parakeet or something like that, then I don't know how many articles they will have on that topic. You may need to go out and do some more research like I'll share with you in the other methods after this for finding content. But uh, if your topic's on weight loss or if you just want top, uh, content on a very general topic, you'll probably find that already here in their big content search. So we can just uh, check the article. We can uh, click on this button to enter it into our Spin Rewriter account. And then all we have to do is click the one-click rewrite to go out and spin uh, hundreds of variations of this. And they do a very deep and unique spinning process, unlike any other spinner that's around. It's very incredible. And uh, luckily, we can do this in just a click of a button and it automatically does all this for us. So as we scroll up, we can actually watch it go through and find different synonyms for each word. We can also select in the settings section if we want to do uh, deeper spinning for like sentence structure spinning as well to make it even more unique and varied uh, on a sentence level. But now it's just going through word for word and getting different variations. And this was a pretty big article. It's usually a lot quicker than this if you have just a few paragraphs, but uh, there's a lot of content here that's coming through and it's finishing up right now. And so now you can see this Huge article is spun uh, with many different synonyms for every single word. 
and uh, we can just click generate a unique version to look at the finished product after everything gets spun. Uh, this will spit out and uh, be ready to use. Or if you need it spin tax, you can just use this form as well. This generated text is 94% unique compared to the original. So you're gonna have a lot of unique variations and it's uh, 1,407 words, so it's huge. So you can go on and use that. And I'm also gonna show you a couple other methods that I like to use to get you some very unique and high quality content as well. You can also find some good PLR articles, meaning private label rights articles that you can use in Google just by searching your niche and PLR articles. So um, there's oftentimes some good free ones. So you can type in free uh, PLR articles. Uh, and then we have sites like freeplrarticles.com or this site, the PLR Boutique. And here we can get some free weight loss articles if we wanna spin those. Now, another method that can be great for getting some unique content you can immediately use with Spin Rewriter is coming to expireddomains.net and enter your niche there. And then use some of the content that has been published on this expired domain that no longer is indexed in Google and no longer is available to the public anymore. So here at expireddomains.net, I can just scroll through and take a look at the domains. I've sorted it by uh, the year, so the birth year of the domain, meaning that uh, by clicking the drop down here, I can see the oldest domains first. And now if we look at this one called a abetterweightlossplan.com, uh, we can see some of the metrics of the domain, but I'm not too interested in that. I just wanna copy it here. And here we are right now at webarchive.org, which is where we can access the Wayback Machine. And this is going to allow us to look at all the historical data of the content on this domain. So even though this domain is expired and available to buy right now, we can actually see what it was like years ago and check out the unique content that it once had. So you just enter in that URL and click uh, enter to do the search. And then we can scroll back to 2004 or any parts of the domain's existence to find different snapshots that were taken uh, of this domain. So as you can see in 2004, there's a variety of different uh, snapshots we can look at. I'm just gonna click into May 25th. And you can see that this once was set up uh, definitely an older style looking website because this is 2004 and we have a membership site. I'm gonna shrink it a little bit so you can see. Looks like it was a membership site here. Uh, some of the images aren't loading, which is perfectly fine. We don't care about that. Uh, and we have categories here. So sometimes the homepage might have a ton of really good content. In this case, there's just uh, some references to um, some products and stuff. So not a whole lot of content in terms of text right here, but we can come down and see the weight loss guide to find um, weight loss basics and motivation links. So I'm just gonna click one of these links and it'll take me to a part of the website, which is again expired and completely down now. But this is a content here that is unique and um, most likely it's nowhere else on the web or no longer anywhere on the web because this site is completely down. So we can just copy some of these weight loss basics if we wanna use this or we can go through and use other things. We have healthy recipes it looks like as well um, if we want any of that content. But that's just another source to get you some very unique content that most likely is no longer anywhere on the internet. So once we have some content, we can just copy and paste into Spin Rewriter. So I'm just gonna paste this in here to uh, rewrite a single article. Then I'm gonna click Start Rewriting. And now Spin Rewriter is gonna go and comb through all this text to find different variations, to find different synonyms for those words. And we can change those, but I'm just going to do one click rewrite just to quickly rewrite this to show you what it'll look like. And as, as you can see, it's combing through all that text, giving you different synonyms for each and every word, sometimes different sentences. Uh, we can also adjust the settings to have it broken down and to uh, alternate the sentences as well to completely change up the sentence structure. Uh, then I'll click finalize article because right now we have all the spin text set up. And as you can see, we have a new and unique variation of this. Uh, this is the seed article that has all the spinning done here. And uh, we can preview that, we can click uh, generate a unique variation if we want, and it'll load up a different variation. 
So as you can see, the original article once said, eat slowly and enjoy your food. And in this variation, it'll say, eat gradually and also appreciate your food. So that's just one way of uh, doing this very quickly to get a bunch of unique content that you can go on to fill in the description for your YouTube videos, to rank your YouTube videos, or you can use this content to post on your blog or your websites or other web properties if you want to get them ranking better. I wouldn't suggest using this content as your main money site content. So if this is like the main homepage of your blog or some of the main sites that you're trying to rank on your blog, then I wouldn't use this article to be the main article that everybody sees or the article that sells your products and services. I would instead either write the one or two articles yourself or get it done in iWriter or some kind of writing services so that you can have a nice looking article for your main content, but then use this content to help backlink or give extra link juice to your main content. You can also use this content to do additional posts. So you could do three to five additional posts using this content, but this content is used to then send link juice and backlink to your original main post. You can also take all these different variations, the spin tax to use for private blog network submissions. So you can send that off to a PBN service, or if you have your own blog network, you can use that, or you can use it on web 2.0 properties, uh, again, to have additional articles that then serve the purpose of backlinking your other property. So backlinking your main website or your main money video. So this is very easy and very convenient to do. Now I'm gonna show you another trick too that you can use for product name keywords. This is really important to protect your main keywords. So right now inside of uh, ClickBank, I'm gonna show you this product called the Cinderella Solution. Now Cinderella Solution is a very popular ClickBank product on weight loss. So if you go into Google and do a search for Cinderella Solution, you'll find different reviews and Google loves the way all this content is worded. It's worded just right to get ranked on the first page of Google. So we can go in here and click into one of these posts and see what content they're using. We could also use this as inspiration for some of the content that we want to do with Spin Rewriter. Now, I certainly wouldn't advocate reusing this word for word at all, but Spin Rewriter will help to make this completely copy skate past, meaning that it's complete unique variations from the original content that you see. So we can take an article like this and come back to our Spin Rewriter account and rewrite that article for a YouTube description or anything else. And all I have to do is paste it in here. And then another important step we have to do is right here where it says one click rewrite. We can click into settings. And in the protected keyword section, we wanna make sure that our main product name keyword is protected. So in this case, we have a product name keyword called Cinderella Solution. Now, if we don't protect that, it may spin and find different syntax and variations for the word solution so that it comes up with something like Cinderella remedy or Cinderella cure, because there's a lot of different words that could be similar to the word solution. I'm not sure if they would find something else for Cinderella or not, but the, the point is that we want to protect the main product name keyword, because otherwise it will find different variations for those terms. So we put in that product name keyword pr to protect it, and then just click the one click rewrite, and it'll go through and rewrite this article to make it very unique. And as you can see, just in two clicks, we have unique variations of this content. Now we can take this content and have unique and keyword optimized content for our video description to rank our video in YouTube and Google. We're using the content that Google loves that is optimized for Cinderella solution. And we'll have many variations of very unique content uh, around this article as well. So we can also take this exact same spin text that we have here and paste it into services for backlinks like SynLab or Social Adder if we wanna get some quality social links. We can use it for services that do any kinds of backlinks or PBNs uh, to help rank our content there as well. The other thing that's really cool about Spin Rewriter is that it has an API that we can use, and this API is used in most SEO uh, software services. So in a service like SynLab, which is something that uh, I've had on a couple of my products before, we have integrated the Spin Rewriter API 
so that you can actually just copy and paste that API into your software program and Spin Rewriter will be inside of there so that you can use it very easily with inside of that software program that you're using. When it comes to article spinners, Spin Rewriter is the best and has been the best for a number of years. Ever since I heard about it in 2013, it's become the market leader and has dominated. So in any kind of SEO software or service that you have that uses a spinner, Spin Rewriter will most likely have a place there uh, for the API so that you can use your Spin Rewriter account in there as well. Now I will be including a number of bonuses for Spin Rewriter if you pick it up through my link below and you can get all the information about the bonuses below this video here as well. And you can get free access to Spin Rewriter for a full five days so you really have nothing to lose. You can try it out and see how you like it. Uh, for me, that's what I first did. I got into my free trial and played around with it. And I definitely re recommend playing around with it, testing it out, and really making it work for you. Don't just wait to get rebuild later or anything. You'll wanna just use it right away. Take advantage of that five day free trial. So click the link below now for your free access of Spin Rewriter. I think you'll be very impressed as I've been throughout the years. Thanks for checking out my Spin Rewriter review. Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next video.